Hey, Sean here from SpeedQBView.com. So it's time for probably the most requested video I've had in the past couple weeks, and it's a comparison of the Chi Yi Wuhua version 2 and the Yushin Red. Both of these are the cosmic magnetic version, and I was gonna make just an individual review of the Wuhua version 2, but I never actually got one from Chi Yi, and I ordered a cosmic magnetic one before I got the original, so this is gonna be a comparison of these. Two. So I had both of them replaced with the sticker shades that I like. These are the fluorescent orange, green, and yellow with a light blue and light red. This is, I guess, a prototype version where the magnets are a little bit lighter. I really like it. I actually told Cameron to keep these light magnets, but compared to the Yushin Red, they're very similar. I guess these ones are just slightly stronger, but very minuscule amount where I think if I had other people try it, they might feel that they're the exact same. The very first thing to compare is going to be the size. The Yushin Red is just slightly smaller and that is a big plus for me. 6x6 is already getting kind of large and even though my hands are not small, I do enjoy that smaller size a little bit better. The internals are pretty much the same size. It more just seems like the external layers are a little bit bigger on the Wuhua. This one did have the spring swap, but the outside layers of the Wuhua are a bit faster than the Yushin Red. The inside layers though, feel a little bit more sluggish compared to the Yushin Red. So just a little bit of a trade-off there. As far as tensioning, now this one, I'm able to keep the Wuhua a little bit lighter tensions than the Yushin Red. And the reason is because it doesn't misalign as much. So I'm able to have a little bit more corner cutting on this for sure. And it does misalign, but it doesn't really get too um, binded up or bound up, whatever the word would be. Yushin Red, I can't get as much corner cutting because if I do, it's going to really bind up. And the uh, last thing I want in a solve is to have to try to move a piece back into place because that just gets frustrating, especially when my solves are just below what cutoffs usually are. Same thing for internal layers. Once we go past about half a piece, it starts to do that. Well, with the Wuhua, I can go a little bit farther. That is the biggest thing. Honestly, they perform both very well, and my times were pretty much identical between the two. I was going back and forth and back and forth on each of these, trying to figure out which one I was going to use because which one was going to get better times and it just seemed to be even with them. I ended up using the Yushin Red. Blake Thompson also used uh, one of my puzzles and I gave him the choice between the two and he tried them and he also chose the Yushin Red. Not to say that this is an overall better puzzle, but just felt more comfortable at that time. It's hard to say, I, both of us chose the Yushin Red to use. But if you don't mind a slightly larger puzzle and you want a little bit more corner cutting and a little bit faster outer layers, then the Wuhua version 2 would be the way to go. So that's honestly pretty much it for the comparison. It's not too much to do. I don't need to go through all the pieces and compare how the slight millimeter difference is between those. So if you have any questions, please leave them in the comment section below. Hit like, subscribe for more content like this in the future. And as always, stop by speedkeepyview.com for more news and reviews.